Hey guys, this is before the crowds are gonna come into Monty's restaurant. We have some of our staff here. Say hi guys. Hi guys. Hello. We have our chef and we have one of our beautiful customers. And we're talking about some of the things that happen in New York City Italian restaurants when non-Italians come in to eat. Who, who could tell us our first thing? Danny, oh, come on, your head's ready to... There you see, Olive Garden should be closed down. People who don't know anything about Italian food or Italian American. They should go to Olive Garden? They go to Olive Garden and I get, they get things like uh, fettuccine Alfredo with chicken and they think it's Italian. Yeah, they don't or do that. in vodka with chicken or this and that with chicken on top. And anything and that, that you guys are seeing, chef? Crepes. Crepes, they want crepes in Italian yeah. restaurants. I have a, well, crepes are Italian. Hold on. Crepes are Italian, Crispelli. And Italians taught the French how to make crepes, <laughs> among I many other crepes dishes. With the French. No, no. Yes, yes. yes. Yeah, but crepes I are originally French Italian. I ordered escargot in an Italian restaurant, and um, she wasn't happy at all. Then she said, "Well, I guess it wasn't a good idea to order those." Well, they actually eat them, bambaluki. Uh, I don't know the exact pronunciation. Snails in Italian. Bambalu. Bambalu. Let me ask you a question. No, Has no. anyone no. Or ever ordered linguine vongole with cheese? No way. No. You never heard any American order linguine and water clam sauce with, with cheese? cheese? Well, I'm not what ordering it. They, they want grated cheese, cheese, cheese on top. top. Uh, I'm wondering. Silvano, if you want Jimmy, to Jimmy, that's Silvano, a sit. I know. I'm going to help for a few things. He'd throw you out. Jimmy and orders Italy, it with you cheese. Can get arrested, uh, All right, Jimmy, we're going to do a video. We're not going to let you put cheese on the Ooh, linguine. I see food pasta. I must say that I chances are I'll put. Well, you'd be arrested in Italy. I don't like cheese. Huh? I don't like. Um, I don't Maybe like not red as much as the white. But I like the white. I Jimmy know, likes the I cheese. Like, and I also drink red He'd wine. He'd be arrested. No, that's okay. Oh, really? No, chef, okay. chef, chef, you have nothing to add to this? He'd be arrested if he went to Italy and did that. Chef, you have nothing to add with your crew and your beautiful customers? <laughs> Italy is the one thing. America is the other. So how, what would you say is the biggest difference for you between Italian restaurants in Italy and Italian restaurants in America? There's got to be a big difference. Because in Italy they're very authentic. And you're saying Italian New York is not? No, but in Italy they love the vongole with the shells. In America, we do pasta, the winner of the chop, chopped up. Take it out of the shell. Take it out of the shell. Out of the so you're saying the Americans want things a bit easier. The Italians are more inclined to work hard for their food. <laughs> well, and the Italians sometimes they, be, they can be a pain in the neck. Oh. Monty's is not Olive Garden. I See that? Do you yeah. like Do you like Monty's? What's your favorite part about Monty's? Danny, Jimmy, or Chef? The wonderful and so wonderful and kind, and and you're so the food is so lovely and you're so friendly and gracious that um, I love this place. Oh, I love it. Well, thank you. I love it. All right, guys. Well, you better come into Monty's before the crowds come in because it's Wednesday. And look at these! Look at these guys. They're ready to go. Can we have a dance, Danny? Show Jimmy our dance. Come on, Rock Jimmy. And roll. Come on, and, Jimmy. And if try you it. Want cheese on seafood? Come see Jimmy. Jimmy will take care of it. And, oh, and, and if you want, and, and if you want to see Jimmy in a famous movie, go see Green Book. <laughs>